And we even arrive in the cover of night. Fuck yes. Attempt to visit a lady. Visit Lady Bryn. The guards glare at you, and you know better than to ask permission to enter. However, as you walk back towards your lodgings, an elderly lady dressed in black approaches you. I am Lady Bryn's nurse, she whispers urgently. Wait for a while. By the spring outside the walls, I will smuggle her ladyship out to meet you, dressed in the guise of a shepherdess. But I beg you, for all of our sakes, be discreet. Wait by the spring. Hey, we did it! And this is the nurse. I humbly request that your lordship keeps his hands where I can see them. I'm surprised you risked your fucking life for this girl. Well done. Thank you. I even took off my helmet for you. I very rarely do that, so you better be pleased. From two to three. Yay, what an increase. Ah, oh, Kairos Moongaze. You must have received my message. How happy I am that you could come. I must tell you. Yes, yes, yes. I know. I know you're... Wait, and is it a different one? I would be so grateful. From what I understand, you already have a jewel on your hands. He is not honor bound to fight you if you are committed to another combat. Please, conclude your other business in a hurry to rescue me from that man's attentions. Hmm. Okay, well, what can we do? Very little, to be honest. There's not much you can do with a lady in this game, which is unfortunate. Unless you download mods and shit. Sounds like... Sound, not those kinds of mods. I mean, unless you're into that, because uh, who wouldn't want to have sex with graphics like this? Mm-mm-mm. Do you think that we may have a future together, my lady? Sir, it is comforting to hear that your intentions towards me are honorable. Perhaps we should take the time to get to allow our affections for each other to grow a little stronger before making any such decision. You're literally indifferent towards me. That is how you feel. Wow. Oh man, she has a controversy of six? She's only 19. Don't know how old my guy is, but this could be a... Uh... No, to be honest, I think he's like in his early 20s, right? It's fine, it's fine. And it's the, uh, it's the it's medieval times anyway. Anything went back then. So, <laughs> we don't have to worry about that. Very well. I shall continue to strive to be worthy of your esteem. Anything else I can do? I don't know any poetry, so I, I can't do the reading poetry thing. Ah, uh, that's it. That's all we can do. That's, uh, let's just pretend we have sex and get out of here. Wonder how people used to dirty talk back in the Middle Ages. Like, oh, thou hast mine dirty harlot. Hark! I, I, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. All right, well, I kept my aunt. We're literally just walking away. We're not even going to do it. She just stays over there as her face becomes slowly more pixelated. Well, nurse, I am. Uh, commands where we could see him. Couldn't make her mind a dirty, filthy harlot, whatever the fuck I was talking about. But now here we are. Oh, yeah, I forgot you can just sort of hang around in the castle uh, grounds. We're done. And I think more options do open up as you sort of build more renown for yourself and stuff like that. Obviously, you can. There is big things you can do down the line, but uh, that will not come for quite some time. So for now, for now, what do we have left to do? We collected taxes. We got ourselves some prisoners. We need to challenge y'all, Turgor, which will make us her absolutely love us, which will be good. And deal with looters, which I completely forgot about. That's in Ravadin. Fuck, I should probably go over to the Kingdom of the Vegas again. I remember I was saying, like, all right, I'm going to find all the looters, and I will see you guys see, like, fucking ages ago. Hours ago at this point. And uh, I guess I just never did. We don't need to get all of them, but I'd like a little more money from it, I guess. I mean, we're very low on money all the damn time. Let's do it. Where am I, anyway? Once again, we find ourselves in a tournament. This one, for some reason, despite being vague here, features a hell of a lot of horses. Which are, to be honest, my favorite types of tournaments in this game. We weren't given... A horse in this one, and all I had to do- I cut everyone down there. That one point we put in strength has made all the goddamn difference. Oh, but that is still a lot of boys. We've got a lance! Oh my god, this is a firing squad. This is the equivalent of a medieval firing squad. But yes, as you can see, lances do damage without you even fucking trying. You have to build up a speed enough for my dude to be bothered to put his lounge in the couch position. Oh my god, we're losing. And then you just have to charge, and it is my favorite way to kill in this entire game, because you can watch bodies fly if you've got a fast enough horse. Unfortunately, since my dude is so bad at pole arms, uh, he doesn't seem to be able to do that very well. Uh-oh, two of them left. I could smash a shield in one, though. Or just slap him in the face with it. Boyar Marmund locked un knocked unconscious by Boyar Gatsia. Or Gastia. Okay, well, I'm the only one left, huh? Uh-oh. I'm not going to be able to move it in time? No. No, no, no. The trouble is, these horses are so immobile, basically. You have to get really lucky to actually do it. I guess I can just do- Oh, my horse is going to die. Come on, couch that fucking lance. Spin around in time. 
Yeah, that ain't happening. That ain't happening. We're gonna hit him at the slowest speed possible. We're gonna have to hit regularly, I think, which uh, does nowhere near as much damage. And oh my god, do you see how slowly I go for it? That's how bad we are with pole arms. Yet all we can use is pole arms. At least we can take out cut, cut, Gastia. All right, who are you? You look like the king or someone. Oh, I thought you had a beard from here. You're a woman. That is, uh, you you definitely do not look like the king. There we go. A whole zero damage. Good job, mate. You know what? One last try at couching her. Ow. Okay, yeah, this ain't happening. This definitely ain't happening. We have a shield. We can defend ourselves if needs be. But I have an idea. We launch ourselves off. We hurry the fuck up and we grab a big... Ah! I can't do any damage with a lance while I'm on, like, while I'm in front of her. There we go. Pick up a sword. Oh, no. Oh, you're not a woman either. What the hell is wrong with me? I can't see today. Of course I picked up one of these. Yes, that was so lucky. It was the king. His beard was just coming in and disappearing. What the hell is wrong with me, man? I must be so sexually confused. There we go. Got ourselves another big sword. Which I should be able to... Oh, I'm trying to use his momentum against him. It is really hard to do, especially when our team is this small. we got to be very careful. There's one team on... Uh-oh. One team on horses, one without. Oh, God. That was a couch damage on us, I think. We're okay. At least a blue boy went down. Yeah, dealing with these horse fuckers is going to be... That's going to be a problem. Did a lot of damage to the horse, though. If I can knock him off his horse, this will be fine. Oh, good. A whole six damage. Amazing. Or if you can get him to stop, they'll just stop. They won't take the... Like, if you can get the, um... You're not my team? For some reason I thought I was blue for a minute. Thank you for knocking him out. Jesus, I got scared then. He nearly destroyed me. Okay, okay, now we corner him. If he can't couch, we've got this. Oh, to, be, to be honest, I think I can block it anyway, but... Uh-oh, don't let him build off speed. What is going on with you? <laughs> what the hell was that? Are you the king again? You're an old man with a beard. You have to be the king. You're not the king. Oh, but you can't beat me with that. You literally can't do damage with, without, a, without a little bit of speed. That's boy our cobble. Demolished. Get the hell out of here. Okay, we are we are just blasting through this. I know I've got the combat like on a low difficulty right now, but I will put it up as soon as I feel like my dude is actually ready. Right now, we're getting a few lucky wins, but we do still nearly die every time, which is as, as it should be. So right now, I'm feeling like this is a good-ass level of challenge. Goodbye, Toru. Man, I'm so good with one-handed weapons now. Who the hell is with us? Kairos Moongaze versus Champion Fighter? We don't we don't want you to win. No one's gonna know which Champion Fighter actually won. You're not going to the feast and flirting with my bitch. It's, I don't think she's gonna be here. It's the Kingdom of Vegas, and I kind of forgot what we were. Uh, I don't like fighting with a two-handed sword, but once we get uh, proficient with those, I might actually switch up to two-handed. I really enjoy the playstyle. Oh, we are rich. You have won the Tournament of Raven You're filled with pride and honor as always and shit. And we made ourselves nearly four grand. 3,980 denarii. We rich, motherfuckers. We rich. Should I flirt with another lady? Should we do it? Should we get a Vega lady on our side? Boy, our Marmoon. Are you going to be pissed that I won? Oh, Doru wears a... He wears a fucking cape. What a badass. All right. Any, uh, any Vega ladies looking particularly sexy? They're all looking particularly ginger, which is not helping. <laughs> Gin I mean, redheads are cool, but like, redheads, not orange heads. <laughs> you know? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It all works. It's just how ugly everyone is in this game. Ah, uh, boy, I'll vulture at the other. No women I want to declare my victory to. Oh, you, this old lady, you will do. No, you won't. Uh, I need to make sure you're single first. I don't want to. I don't want to fuck up my relationship with a with the relationship with a boy. Ah, I mean you're fine. You must be Kairos Moongaze. We just had the honor of watching you distinguish yourself. Blah 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 blah. Ah, uh, you do are not married, my lady. I would like to profess my success, dedicate my success in this recent tournament to you. Why, thank you. You're most kind to do so. Is there anything else? Uh, I would like to profess myself my your most ardent admirer, blah, blah, blah. Hmm, you're a bold one, but I like that. I would like it very much if we could see more of each other. Wow, she actually went up for once instead of for some reason going down. Even though she was like, ah, oh, yes, I'd love to see you. She hated me more for admitting it. Yeah, she likes the chase, does uh, Bryn or whatever the hell her name was. But you already like me more than Bryn. You're an interesting prospect. And you look the exact same. Twins, huh? Interesting. 
We can work with twins. But anyway, let's uh, let's find the king. Hopefully the king will uh, notice us. What will you say? We meet again, Kairos Moongaze. I wish to welcome you to my hall on this auspicious occasion. Now, what is it? Do you have any tasks for me? No, Kairos Moongaze, I do not need your help. Oh my god. I have met in my travels one who calls himself Prince Valdem the Bastard. Oh really? It is not everyone who dares mention that name in my presence. Not sure whether to reward your bravery or punish you for your impudence. Imp impotence. Yes, that floppy penis angers me. I'm in impudence. There we go. Very well. I will indulge your curiosity. Listen closely, because I do not wish to speak of this matter again. Were Valdim to come to me in peace, I would laden him with titles and honors, and he would become the greatest of my vassals. But as he comes in war, I will drag him before me in chains and make him acknowledge me as the rightful sovereign and cut his tongue from his mouth so that he cannot recant. Whatever my father may or may not have done to secure the throne does not matter. I have inherited it, and that is final. If every old claim were to be brought up anew, if every man's inheritance can be called into question at any time, and it would be the end of the institution of kingship, and we would live in a state of constant civil war. You're not wrong. To be honest, at least about, about the part of, like, uh, if every old claim would be brought up anew, it would be disastrous. Then in which case, I beg my leave. We're leaving. Big Daddy Sexy Champion Kairos is on his way. See you later, boyars. I'm a Nord now. Ah, we can finally make a little money at the Ransom Broker, huh? Well, we'll get rid of all our Kurgits, because we're not at war with those, and I feel a little weird holding on to them. Swadian Man at Arms, I should probably get rid of, because we only really need the Militia. Let's get rid of the Crossbowmen, the Footmen, and the Nord Warriors, since they're ours. Sea Raiders can go, Nord Warriors can go. Oh, we are rich, coupled with those tournament victories and whatever the hell else we've done. We got 10k, as well as a few more prisoners... I'll keep behind just in case. And while I'm here, it also opened up my company screen. So camp follower, please. And you're the only one who's leveled up. Borcha and me, however, have also leveled. I didn't realize I had. Fuck. Uh, strength, please. Mine with another power strike. We need to do more damage, please. All the goddamn time. I, know I just want to get better and better and better. And I'm actually going to upgrade my pole arms. Because I really like using lances. I just very rarely get a chance to. Wandering Scald. Greetings to you, most noble sir. Hmm. Can you teach me any poems? I can teach you part of the saga of Helgograd and Kara. It is hero a heroic tale full of blood and battle. The shield maiden Kara chooses the warrior Helgograd, as or Helgared, sorry, as her lover, as he is the only man who can defeat her in combat. Her father, who pledged her to another, comes with his sons and his huskars to kill Helgared. They fight. And Helgared and Kara slaughter the entire host, except for Kara's beloved younger brother, who, alas, grows up to avenge his father by slaying Helgared. The depiction of a warrior and a shield maiden, as equals, will appeal to some women, but a male wearing blood spattered heroine will shock and repulse others. To teach it to you, I will need some hours of your, of your time, and of course, a small fee for my services. About 300 dinars would survive, that's more than most villages even own. But yeah, I'll take it. Very well. Repeat after me. A light pierced the gloom over Vachek Cliffs, where charge of surf broke on shield wall of shore. Grey helmeted and grey cloaked, the maiden stood. On wave steeds prow, the sailcloth snapping, over din of oars of timbers cracking, she cried out to her hearth brothers, arrayed for war. A light pierced the gloom over Vachek Cliffs. Very good, but there are many stanzas to go. Now listen closely. Adorable. I doubt the ones that we've met would like that. They seem a little girlier than those. So I don't think they'd appreciate, um, you know, the scary, angry shit that we don't. We're not allowed in the fucking, oh, wow. Not allowed in the feast hall now, even after we won once. Tend to visit a lady. I know she's busy at the feast, but will you let me in? No. God damn, I'm not even gonna read that. Okay, well, I guess we're leaving Raven in. Ooh, hello. 
Oh, man, Hunters following deserters, though. At least we can help kill the deserters. Right after I've finished a tournament, but oh, the Manhunter's left, you fuckers. Fine, run from me instead. He's even imprisoned a Manhunter and I want him on my team. How fast are you? 6.2, 6.2. Eventually, we should catch up, assuming they make- Ah, oh, fuck. I was gonna say, assuming they make mistakes, but they led me into Swadia. Clever bastards. Clever bastards. I'm, I'm afraid of Swadia, I must say. Who looted Mekin? You bastards. You fucking bi cared so much about this place I've never visited. Fine, let's make our way to Nudar Castle. And no one's here. Damn. I love that the castles just have big prisons, though. That's so cool. You being looted or are you being... Yeah, you've already looted. Hello, Count Meltor. I'm being followed. He wants me. He wants my ass, my pretty little ass. Logar, soon I need you. And now he's running, huh? Running from me? Where are you going? No, I want a friend. He occasionally runs for me, occasionally chases me. Are you scared of someone else? No, he just now he's just deciding to travel elsewhere. We have the exact same party size, but you have way, 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 way better troops. And most of your, oh yeah, your party's only 26 out of 42 though. We could do this. This would be an amazing victory for us. But I'd also be killing a Swadian. A group of people I don't necessarily despise yet. And if anything, probably want to become friends with. Swadia is my favorite kingdom in the game. At least favorite to work with. And we're on 96 enthusiastic. Man, we got a good old team here then. Tell me about your skills. Let's give you even more intellect. You're going to become the smartest man ever to live. And maybe throw down some tracking and trainer points? I want a very high level team. So I guess that makes sense. We don't have a helmet for you yet. Huh? We just, we're just not finding helmets. Uh, I bought my dudes a, a load of fucking meat, by the way, just to make them happy. So I guess that's why you like me a little more than normal as well. Hmm. Quests. Ah, yeah, we should go find Yarl Durrigan. We should challenge this boy. And we should probably bring these prisoners at some point, but we got ages to do that. Uh, God damn. I just don't know what to do. He's fucking looting all the city, all the villages, but I can't take him on without losing a lot of men anyway. wonder where Turagor is. Lord of Kulum and Vyashek. Renown 641. Holy shit. How do I see my own renown? No, 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 no. Statistics. There we go. Number of troops killed, 25. Number of troops wounded, 68. Number of friendly troops killed, zero. Friendly troops wounded. That's not what I want. That's not those stats. I want... But it is cool you have a kill count. I didn't know that. I've killed a decent amount of people already. Uh, no, I don't want to go here. I want to see my... Renown and shit. Maybe it's in reports. Character report. There we go. Renown 74 on a rating zero. I guess because I did send out that man. You are not reading any books. That shows up in, a, in the fucking stat screen. Amazing. Ah, courtship relations. Lady Harris and Lady Bryn. Poems known. Helgared and Kara. Epic. Sure, I don't really know what that means. Party size minus 41. Leadership plus 36. Food variety plus 45. Recent events minus 12. What recent events? What did I do? Is it because I ran away from a dude? We had to. I don't know what recent events they could be. Oh boy, more war to deal with. Swadia and the Kyrgyz. Hmm, maybe we'll get another ally in this war. Which means we'll love the Kyrgyz, which will be weird. I'm used to the Kyrgyz always being my first enemy. I don't know why. They're just very angry dudes and they like to go to war with a lot of people. But uh, not this time around, apparently. Not this time. I don't know where I'm going. Need to find Durrigan. Durrigan is our next target. I'm sort of just rambling. Sorry about that, guys. Let's have a look at what could be in Telerog, shall we? As the saga of Kairos Moongaze continues. Oh man, what a gorgeous fucking castle. He's got his own banners up everywhere. Man, I cannot wait till we own a fife. It's a long way off. We're still early days right now. Still a young boy not knowing what the hell to do, but that's fine with me. So, y'all who? What a badass you are, Yarl Riamald. I like your face. Do I know you? I am Kairos Moongaze. Blah, 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 you're a man. Do you have any tasks for me? Send a letter to Yarl Olaf. Oh my god, the dad of the girl I'm trying to wang. What? Wang? <laughs> what the hell was that? I tried to say bang and wangle at the same time. We got wang. So, uh, yeah, the girl I'm trying to wang, apparently. Yeah, let's go to, let's go to Harus Castle. Because that gives me an excuse to see her as well, even though we did just do that. I appreciate it, Moongaze. Is the letter 
and a small sum to cover your travel expenses. Give my regards to Jarl Olaf when you see him. But not until you tell me where, uh... I'd like to know where Turagor is. That's the dude we need to beat up, right? But it's such a cool name. I don't want him as an enemy. Ah, it's your son! Jarl Durigan. Jarl Durigan is currently at Sargoth. And let's make our way there, shall we? Sargoth is the coolest name in the fucking world, dude. I once, um, when I was into programming, like, back in, like, high school, I, I once tried to name, uh, I, I once called a video game I was working on, it was, like, ASCII fucking game. Reminds me a little bit of Sanctuary RPG. Um, I was once working on a game that I just called Sargoth, because I thought it was the coolest word in the world back then. Fuck me, I was a nerd. Uh, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> look at me, I'm still playing, of course I am. Hello, Prince Valden, that's you, y'all. Derrigan! We meet again, Kairos. What is it? How did such a sexy man give birth to such a bowl cut ginger? <laughs> Whatever. Uh, about the task you gave me. Yes. Have you made any progress on it? Here are all the taxes from Furishen. It comes to 4,343 dinar. That's why I'm so rich. I had all his tax money on me. Well done, Moongaze. Very well done indeed. You truly were the right man for the job. Here's some money, blah, blah, blah. Do you have any more tasks for me? Well, some of the serfs working my fields in Firishan have run away. Wow, you're such a horrible lord, but I have to help. I have run away, the ungrateful swine. I let them plow my fields and rent my cottages, and this is how they repay me. Ha! From, where, from what I've been hearing, they're running to tear as fast as they can, and have split up into three groups to try and avoid capture. I want you to capture all three groups and fetch them back to Firishan by whatever means necessary. Should really have them hanged for attempting to escape, but we need hands for the upcoming harvest. It's almost harvest in season, so I'll let them. I'll let them off. Go on. I'll let them go off this time with a good beating. Now I'm saying it nicely, so there's a chance I can just be like, "No, I'm busy," and he won't hate me. But whoever does it, it'll happen anyway. Maybe I can free them. You can count on me, sire. Excellent, Kairos. Excellent. I have every confidence in you. Hmm. And you're just allowing this, Valdem? You might not be the good fucking king that we assumed you could be. How about you, Adelisa? What a cool name. But you look disgusting, so you're no longer cool in my eyes. Hello, Kairos. What brings you here today? I want to improve my relation with the Lord, you don't like me. Can I be your champion? No. Damn it! Normally it's quite common that the, uh, the women of the game need your help, but apparently not this time. Alright, whatever, whatever. Let's go track down those thieves. Running to tear, I believe he said, right? We better hurry then, and... My god, why was it waiting? Sargoth patrol, are you not gonna help me out fucking Sargoth assholes? Okay, go, 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 go. Hopefully this is all three groups. I, I don't really know how this works. Good day, sir. I've been sent by your Jarl Durigan, whom you are running from. He will not punish you if you return now. My good sir, our lives at our village fearish and was unbearable. We worked all day long and still went to bed hungry. We're going to tear to start a new life where we'll be treated as humans. You've gone against our laws by running from your bondage. You'll go back to Firishan now. Well, maybe you are right. All right, then. If anyone asks... If anyone asks... <laughs> that's meant to be a horse sound. I don't know how to make a horse sound, but he interrupted me while I was saying it. So that's our answer. God bless you, sir. We will not forget your help. Firish and love me, huh? Can I now just turn on them? I'm not gonna, but is it possible? Don't worry. If anyone asks, we haven't seen you. Go quickly. God bless you, sir. Fuck me. Bet y'all Turrier has seen me and he doesn't like me because I never do their jobs correctly. We meet again, Moongaze. What is it? How many tasks for me? Do you even trust me with tasks anymore? He does not, does he? Wish to ask you. Uh, let's talk in private. Uh, you have piqued my interest. What do you have to say? I heard you've quarreled with y'all Serden. There's no secret. My nephew y'all Serden. I'm sorry to say, is far too soft-hearted to be a man of a... Soft-hearted a man to be given any kind of responsibility. His chivalry will allow the enemy to flee to fight another day. Will cost the lives of my own faithful men. Hmm. 
Can I not mess with that? Can I not do something about it? Apparently not. Not right now, anyway. Maybe because I'm not a vassal. How do you feel about King Ragnar? King Ragnar? Long may he live! Fair enough. He does seem like a good king. Ah, very good. Seems somehow more benevolent than Yarl, uh, than, sorry, uh, King Yaraglek and people like that. Who is the only other king we've met, I must admit. I don't even remember who leads the Vegas. I think it's Sultan Hakim leads Saranid. Khan someone leads the Kyrgyz. And... God, who else? Don't know who leads the Rodox. Can't even remember who leads the fucking... Swadians, and they're my favorite boys. I think it starts with an H, and he's a badass, but whatever. Sounds like Haringoth, but it's not. Maybe his name is on one of their... It's not Durham. It's not Uxkarl. Oh my god, do they... Oh, and it's not Suno or Praven. Huh. Yeah, I can't remember your name. That's a bad sign.